Construction of three phase transformer. We are going to see the construction of three phase transformer. Laminated and well insulated iron cores are used for the completion of the magnetic circuit and to reduce iron and eddy current losses. Laminated sheets are assembled in a series manner and to form the laminated core. The thickness of a core is kept 0.5 mm. The windings are wounded in the limb. Insulations are used between the high voltage and low voltage windings to prevent the short circuit. The primary and secondary winding are placed for the transformation of power. These may be wound in cylindrical or sandwich types. High voltage insulated sheet The tank or box protects all the windings and cores from the atmospheric effect. The three-phase winding is inserted into the tank. The conservator is the drum which is used as oil storage tank and it is mounted on the top of the transformer. The oil level indicator is used to indicate the oil level in the conservator. A breather is used to prevent the transformer oil from the atmospheric pressure. Buchholz relay is installed between the transformer tank and conservator. Buchholz relay is a gas actuated relay installed in oil immersed transformers for protection against all kinds of faults. Buchholz relay detects the incipient faults at a stage much earlier than is possible with other forms of protection. The bushings provide proper insulation between live conductor and earthed tank. Explosion vent provides an exit path to the gases produced in the transformer due to all kinds of faults. Diaphragm is used to discharge excess pressure in the atmosphere when excess pressure is developed inside the transformer during loading. These are used for transformer cooling purpose. Temperature gauge is a thermometer which is mounted on the transformer to measure its temperature. Drain valve is used to drain oil from the transformer. Oil is used for cooling purpose. The oil used should not have a flash point less than 160 degrees Celsius. Oil filled in tank. The freezing point should not be higher than 15 degrees Celsius and its viscosity should be 30 degrees Celsius and 15 degrees Celsius.